the, our country at this point, and indeed at any point, uh, should embark on public-private partnership to ensure that uh, we free our scarce resources for social uh, development, particularly education and health and similar subsectors. Uh, I believe that at this point in our history, with very limited uh, resources, we need to encourage the private sector to participate in the development of infrastructure in our country. And of course, this is the practice. But one thing is clear, that we have to provide the environment, a convenient environment, a safe environment for the public and for the private sector to be convinced that their investments will provide the kind of return that they aspire to get and that there is the legal framework to protect their investments. No matter how hard we wish to encourage the private sector to participate in our economy, if the investments do not appear to be fully protected or they feel unsafe, we will be disappointed. So I believe that this is a very important bill and um, it is for us in government, both the executive and the legislature, particularly the two arms, to work hard to provide the kind of climate of ease of doing business, security and safety to promote and protect private sector investment in our country. I believe that Nigeria has the kind of population that will encourage any private sector investment to come. What may be a setback at the moment is the security uh, challenge that we face. But thank God we are doing well and we we'll continue to do so. But this is one, one bill that all of us uh, in the legislature, and I'm sure even the executive arm of government, would like to see it become a law, and a law that will also be fully implemented uh, for the benefit of our country. So with these remarks, I put the question, those in favor that this bill be now read a second time, say aye. Those against say nay, the ayes have it. Clerk of the Senate. Mr. President, distinguished Act to repeal the Infrastructure Concession Regulatory Commission Act 2005 and enact the Public Private Partnership Regulatory Commission to strengthen and enhance the supervisory role of the Commission and effectively position it in regulating the participation of the public and private sectors in financing of construction, development, designing, operation, or maintenance of infrastructure and for related matters 20 to 21 second reading taken, and the bill is referred to the Committee on Works to report back within four weeks. Thank you very much. Leader of the Senate, last. Mr. President, my highly respected and distinguished